respect that we are family members. I will be reading Dharma News. Dharma News gives you just point by point achievements of India in almost all the fields. Just to inform you what India was, what India is and what India will be. These messages in detail are uploaded in dharmanews.in Now I will be entering into the subject. <coughs> the salaries of chief executive officers, managing directors, chairmen of big companies have shot up like anything. Many of the CEOs are getting the salaries 50 crore, 45 crore and l and is giving 64.45 crore rupees per annum for its CEO. Next point, Karnataka is becoming the very hot spot for industrial development, Digital India, Make in India projects. Coal India conducted separate auction for power projects and now unlike the earlier days, the power project Thermal power plant will be having their own coal mines for producing maximum electricity. French based Renault started producing 50,000 cars in India per annum. Asian paints started spreading throughout India. In different states they are establishing their branches. Government of India is doing its level best for getting suggestions from the common man. New energy policy of government of India will be coming out within five weeks, keeping the environment as the most priority area. Fast track procurement committee panel for railways and electricity projects have been established. For procuring and purchasing any material, this fast track committee will be doing its level best. Information technology special economic zone in Bengal has been inaugurated. Chinese super telecom company Li Kos Three brands of products will be available in India and the first brand costs 59,000 rupees. l and CEO Group Executive come Chairman, his salary has reached 66.14 crore rupees per annum. India is moving like other developed countries where CEOs gets more than 100 or 150 crore per annum. Global economists say great opportunities are waiting for industrialists in India, particularly after passing the GST bill. Policy changes are highly meritorious for oil and natural gas industry. GST will simplify all the tax operation in India. 2.27 crore people file income tax return through E-line and it was only 71 lakh last year. This year 2.27 crore people filed IT returns. GST <coughs> is the Rashtra Nidhi above Rajanidhi said the Prime Minister of India. 
man, machine, material, money, minutes. These are the five M's which we should focus. Man, machine, material, money and minutes. Five points mentioned by Prime Minister of India. Foreign direct investment increase in a week through the share bank 2300 crores. This financial year the investment in the sharehold from foreign countries touched 28 crore rupees. Indian Navy chief will be visiting Indonesia particularly in the wake of the threat from China and China South Sea area. Kashmiri terrorist requested Pakistan to assist Indian terrorist for getting Kashmir joined with Pakistan. Next Chandrayaan project of ISRO will be 95 percent or more than that indigenous in nature which will be launched by the end of 2017 or 18. Legal opinion received by government of India says that Sakir Naik's operation can be banned and the work and the organization can be declared as illegal. <coughs> Slovenian light aircraft believed to be the first batch namely virus SW8 made of carbon fiber reached India as per India government's purchase order. US President candidate Trump said that U.S. will deal with Pakistan harshly and cut all the assistance provided to Pakistan if he becomes the President of America. India decided to fix supersonic Brahmos missiles in Arunachal Pradesh to meet the Chinese threat. <coughs> Kashmiri terrorist leader said fourth war against India has started. September 29th will be the date for the auctioning of mobile spectrum in India expecting 5.63 lakh crore rupees as the base price. Steel consumption of India decreased by 7% and now in the month of June the steel consumed in India 6.3 million ton. Police arrested school managers from various parts of the country who prevented the children chanting the national anthem. PM said world countries and nations now are interdependent and no country can exist alone in a single group. 37,000 freedom fighters will be benefited due to the pension change declared by Prime Minister of India during the Independence Day. <coughs> Australia has shown keen interest in nuclear business with India, creating identity for India and transforming India, fulfilling the dreams of Sardar Patel are the three major tasks in front of the Prime Minister of India. Swaraj and Suraj are the two major words to be adopted in policy making. Suraj is great glorious country, Suraj is our own country. Global Innovation Index GII has shown that India has crossed 15 points and reaching at the 66th level, formerly it was 81st level, 81 level, now it is 66 level. India pledges to end tax terrorism through the implementation of GST. Rupees 5400 crore rupees poured from foreign country this week into the share market. Discussion with the Qatar for importing the oil for a long period could save 20,000 crore rupees for India in the import cost. Akshay Kumar's last cinema was fantastic for creating patriotism and respect to goods. Indian soldiers. The next movie namely crack will also be playing the same role of creating inspiration and patriotism in the mind of the people. Army soldier in Kashmir climbed a telecom tower for removing the Pakistan flag in the Independence Day of India. 
last year from Pakistan 674 infiltration incident took place and 738 terrorist attack also took place towards India. New Air Force airfield in Arunachal Pradesh, hardly 100 kilometers from Chinese border, has been inaugurated. This is exclusively to meet the threat from China towards India. Ultra-modern battlefield weapon will be replacing Siachen border and Siachen is the world's highest battlefield. Most sophisticated battle tools getting developed and deployed in Andaman and in India-China border to meet the threat from China. ISRO is preparing for launching 2200 kg meteorological satellite by September 2016, that is next month. Indian Defense Minister compared Pakistan with the hell of the world. By this, the news is over. This news will be available in the website of IISH and also Dharma News site. Thank you very much.